is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman, this is the Tiger Financial News Network 10 o'clock market update on this uh, uh, Thursday, the 19th of September. Wow, Dow spiked high, it's up 541,993. Who does it like the Fed move? Well, we'll see by Monday or Tuesday because we need to see how this resolves. Overnight, huge, huge move to the upside. Right in the Chapman Wave inside track, repellent zone in the weekly chart, leg D. Daily doji candle leg D. Is this a very short term top? Or for subscribers to my opening call, we kind of preparing to see whether or not what happens uh, later in the day. Let's go to the SP. The SP is also spiked up huge. It is up 84 at 5702.4, making a new all time high. So there was a peak C1, C2. So this is either a leg D or an A. I have to have an alternate count because we need to see what happens next. If there are another two peaks to the upside, that's going to be very important. Meantime, uh, the key support is the 50, I'd say 5650 area. Let's go to the QQQ. Uh, QQ's up 2.16%, Dow's up 1.2%, S&P's up 1.5%. So this is at 481.64, spiked higher. Yep, it's trying to get to that left side high. It's still underperforming. Uh, but it's very good at 481, up 10. Let's go to the IWM. IWM is up 1.3%. It's up 3 at 222.57. It did go higher. Hasn't taken out yesterday's high, but we've got this beautiful um, U-shaped pattern that goes to a U and then a W in the same time frame. So we're going to be watching this very closely. And let's go to gold. Uh, gold had a nice move to the upside before. It's now up only 2.8%. It's in leg D. It could be making a PD right now at 2601. Let's go to the dollar. The dollar should be running just a little bit. Yeah, it's uh, up 0.02 at 100.96. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil right now is up in leg B. It's starting to move. Uh, it's got a not yet a buy signal, but it's actually moving quite nicely to the upside. But the most important thing is the bonds. That TLT plummeted from that peak E that was formed yesterday with it high in the 101s. And now we are at 99.06, down 52. Um, I'm watching this closely because all of a sudden the, the Fed wants to have yields come down. But in fact, we're going 